police drama in Tel Aviv. A man planning suicide in the apartment building where Yitzhak Rabin's widow lives. He claimed his briefcase contained a bomb. Painclothes officers talked him out of the building into a nearby park. Pipe in mouth, the bearded man paced around as police watched him. Then he began running. Shops and cafes in a nearby pedestrian precinct emptied as police caught up with the man and subdued him. They wouldn't say if the briefcase really did hold the bomb. But the man had smashed a security camera on his way into the building. And he then took the elevator to the floor where Leah Rabin lives. In a calm Hebron, Palestinian police and Israeli soldiers were briefed by their commanding officers before setting out on joint security patrol. They're part of the deal that gave the Palestinians self-rule in 80% of the West Bank city. But Hebron remains a tinderbox. The 400 militant Jewish settlers who live in the midst of 120,000 Palestinians are determined not to be pushed or frightened out.